think? That was unbelievable. You okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm... Uh, I'm just tired. Tired? Yeah, you know, I, I better turn in. The, those drinks have really gotten to me. It's It's been a long night. I thought after that kiss she maybe you I'm, wanna... I'm sorry, Hank. I didn't mean to lead you on. It's just after everything that's happened, you know, the attempts made on my life, the, the trip back to the States, all that's gone on with Luis, I, I'm just really tired. You still regret having Luis arrested? I did what I thought was right at the time. You know, I feel bad about Luis being locked up, but what can I do about it now? Well, don't worry about it. Sam's going to straighten everything out. I hope so. Sheriff? Sure. Hey, you're back home. Yeah, I just got in. Ethan? Hank? Um, well, I'm going to get going. Uh, I'll call you in the morning. Not too early. Thanks for everything. No problem. See you, Ethan. See you, Hank. I didn't just see what I think I saw, did I? I don't know. Well, you and Hank... It's, and... it's not what you think, Ethan. Hank is a great guy, but... You know, they're just some people you don't feel anything romantic for. No bells, huh? No bells. Not yet, anyway. My heart's just not there. And because your heart is still with Luis. That doesn't mean that my heart's with him. We've just been spending a lot of time together lately. You know, he just happens to be on my mind. So you don't have feelings for Luis? No. The only thing that I feel for Luis right now is anger. Well, that's because he kidnapped you. How'd you know about that? Pilar told me. Oh, she must be so upset. Yes, she is. You don't feel guilty for signing that complaint and having Luis put in jail? I did. And now? Well, now, I, I don't care. I mean, you know, he, he wants nothing to do with me. I, I can't even figure him out. You seem pretty confused. Wouldn't you be? I am. I mean... The guy spends his own money to fly to Paris to risk his life trying to save yours. But before you leave France, you overhear him on the phone talking to someone about how he's using you and he doesn't even care for you? That doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Cranes have used and abused my family for years. Now I finally got a chance to use one of them. A spoiled princess. Sheridan. Maybe Julian was right. How could he have known that I shouldn't have trusted Luis? How could he have been so sure? Are you sure it was Luis you overheard on the cell phone that night at the wharf? Yes, Ethan, I'm positive. I heard his voice, I saw his face. I mean, unless he is a twin. Um, I'm sorry for bringing you up. No. I'm glad you did, actually. <sighs> Reminds me of why I left Harmony in the first place. Luis Lopez Fitzgerald is just like every other guy I've dated, just another user. Uh, I'm sorry things didn't work out. Though I can't say I mind having my favorite aunt back in town. Well, then give your favorite aunt a big hug. <laughs> hmm. Oh, looks like this place hasn't been cleaned since you left. Yeah, who cares? Well, nobody expected you back so soon. Yeah, least of all me. Look, why don't you come back up to the house? Sleep there tonight. Be more cozy. Sold. Good. <laughs> you know, this may sound odd, but I think when it comes to Luis, you should listen to your heart. You know, that does sound odd, considering how the guy used me. I remember it. And this guy saved your life at the risk of his own. You know, tell me something. What if you found out you were wrong? That Luis never said anything about using you? That would change everything. What are we doing in here? I just want to leave a note for Pilar to have the maids clean my cottage in the morning. Well, you know Father hates anyone being here when he's not here. He's very territorial about his library. 
to hell with Julian and his precious library. I mean, what's in here anyhow? It's like he's always hiding something. God. I can remember when this used to be grandfather's office. He used to think that this desk held all the secrets to the world. Yeah. I wonder what secrets it holds today.